Yeah. Jump. The mediocrity has got to me. That's why I separate myself from the rest like an apostrophe. I'm not to be forgotten, G. Soup kitchen flow for these hoes. You know, hot and free. I'm not trying to get rich. I just wanna prepare your mind for the paradigm shift. So why are you here? Well, I think it kind of says it all. I am a mother. I'm an activist. I'm a lawyer. My daughter just got back from Afghanistan. This young lady was waiting for a bus right next to her when an IED exploded within feet of my daughter. These are the three other guys that were killed right there with my daughter standing right there. And as tears come to my eyes right now, I can't fucking believe that I could have lost my child for oil. You know, my child was protecting contractors from Rayathon and Halliburton. That's what my daughter was doing there. She was not doing anything for freedom. She was not doing anything for the American people. I am here because it's time for the people to have a voice. And I just feel like our government is so incredibly corrupt. I mean, they're so evil. Stop corporate greed. No KXL, no GMOs, no fluoride. I mean, what else can you say? Everything. This country's fucked up. If we would take one leg of the military industrial complex away, if we would stop spending that many, what is it, 217 trillion a year, if we would just take that away, they'd have to figure something else out. They are making millions and millions and millions. We spend 26 times what the next five countries put together spend on defense, and nobody's over here to kick our ass. You know, it's it is it is a game. It is, you know, it's just it's ludicrous. And, and I don't know where to start. I don't know what to do really to get involved. This is kind of just like I thought I'd take a chance, and I think it's the right thing to do. It's it's time. I can't sit back anymore and just wait for somebody else to do something. You know, expect for other people to do what I'm supposed to do. This is my job. My job as a citizen is to take back this country, and it's gonna it's gonna happen with little little events like this, and hopefully the word will spread. We're here today. I found you guys. We all found each other. I don't know any of you, you know. And I've been reading posts all over the internet. I started out on this little adventure totally democratic um i was i'm a status quo person i went to law school i drive a mercedes i like the shit the way it was so i thought and then i started finding out how it really was and i just can't i mean i'll probably you know i'll probably get arrested not today but in the near future can't go anywhere without being watched i mean our text messages are being surveilled our conversations Everything that we say and we do is being put into a, a giant portfolio and if we're not subscribing to the, you know, government agenda, then we're targeted as terrorists. I'm a hardworking citizen, I pay my taxes, I do everything that I'm supposed to do and I'm, I'm a terrorist. So it's out of control. I mean, I just, I don't know, like I said, I don't know what else to do, but I have to do something, and this is what I think. I, I think it's a good start. You know, you can start on small scales. Don't eat at McDonald's, hello. Don't shop at fucking Walmart, you know. Start saying things with your dollar, okay? It's really hard. I don't go to banks anymore. It's a pain in the ass. I have to get money orders, but you know what? I've loaned the banks enough money. They haven't done a damn thing for me. Have they done anything for you? Do you like those $28 charges every time you're overdrawn? So. Pay with money. Don't shop at corporations, you know. Go to organic grocers. You can do these things. We don't have to go out and throw a brick at, you know, the federal building. You know, because I don't intend to do that. I like my law license. But, you know, we can, we can say things with our dollars. So, yeah, let's start there.
The military industrial complex involvement really needs to be put into context. Conflict of interest, they'll profit from peace. Contracts to rebuild at the bomb in the streets. While you were sound asleep, they were on a mission to stabilize the governments with economic hitmen. Nobody listened to Eisenhower's speech. Now the power of the monster has gotten out of reach. You have got to see the root of this insanity.